What is going on guys, DBG here, and today we are going to be doing something a little bit different. So I always like making these videos showing you guys like the true pack odds. But first of all, I'm a small sample size, and second of all, the dude that used to give me, let me use his account for a uh, PC, he hasn't hit me up yet this year, so um, I'm not giving 2k any of my money, and I'm also not going to break TOS, which I haven't done in a long, long time. So that's just uh, that's something that is not going to happen. What we are going to do in this video is we are going to look over a number of my team creators. We are go and we are going to be calculating how many packs they opened, the overall dollar cost of those packs. As well as that, we are going to be calculating basically the odds of getting specific things to see if 2K are being 100% transparent with their odds. Or whether their actual odds are a little bit better. Obviously, this is a small sample size, but lads, this is my time that I say, if you are over the age of 18, do what you want with your money. I would not advise you to spend it in packs, but look, do what you want. If you're under the age of 18, I'm conf I can happily in good conscience say don't open packs. This is gambling. This is gambling. There's nothing good to be gained from it if you are under the age. There's nothing good to be gained from this. If you are under the age of 18, um, I just straight up believe you should not be gambling. You should absolutely not be gambling. There's a reason why packs are illegal in a lot of European countries. The reason why within the next three or four years, it's likely that most European countries, these will be illegal in a three plus game. Obviously in America, it's a little bit different. Very, very far behind in terms of gambling laws. Where in America, they're only starting to legalize things like this. But lads, this is going to be uh, illegal very soon. So you guys are just going to see what these are like right here. So the odds on these packs. Right now. There is a 10% chance, apparently, at an Amethyst. A less than 2%, less than 2%, 92 and 95. No one knows what less than 2% is. Again, this is 2K's ability to stay on the line of legality. Again, the country, there are countries where the odds are necessary. And the less than 2% keeps them just about on the line of legality. And now this puts to bed anyone who's, who believes that the less than 2% means it has to be between 1.5 and 2%. No, it's impossible for two things to be between 1.5 and 2%. The odds realistically are probably 1.5% of the diamond and 0.5% at an amethyst. In and around, or 0.5% at a pink diamond, in and around those odds. So, we are now going to be looking at the odds right here. So, I have, in these odds, I have also taken into account um, base set amethysts as, um, as rubies and lower. So, rubies lower and base set amethyst are in this. So, we're going to be looking right here at the spreadsheet. So, I watched most of the YouTube videos. I had somebody watching a lot of these streams. So, you're going to be seeing here. So, the first person is a Spanish streamer, uh, Kerpener. Kerpener23. I do apologize if I have butchered his name. So, let's move the Yuda picture to the side. Okay. So, he bought 120 pack box. 120 pat box. He got one Pippin. He got one Scotty Pippin. And he got 20 rubies or lower. 120 pack box. He got one shake. And I'm not sure. Again, this is not one of the ones that I watched. I'm not sure whether that one shake was part of the. Um, I'm not sure whether one shake was part of the topper or not. But lads, 187,000. Like you do realize. At, if you spend $50 in this game, you have 13,000 VC left. You can buy one more pack. This is 50 quid for 20 rubies and lower and one Scotty. The next person is Rookie Cam. So this is where we see our first Anthony Davis pull. Rookie Cam right here. 32 rubies and lower. He bought, I think, is that three boxes? Or say two boxes? There should be definitely more. No, no, he didn't buy three. He didn't buy two boxes. I would say like no, two boxes isn't is more than three five six. Yeah, that's more. That's like three seven, three seventy something. So, rubies and lower, thirty two, one Robman, three Scotties, and one Anthony Davis. So so far we are at over five hundred thousand. Over 500,000. Um, we have seen 
one pink diamond, zero diamonds. Through, I should say, roughly, say 55 packs or 50, three, four, five. So through 58 packs, we've got five amethysts, which is right, which is give or take in and around the 10%, which is correct. One pink diamond, no diamonds. So yeah, the less than 2% is real. So we are, we're well and truly on track. So imagine spending the best part of 100 quid. And in fairness, if you got AD, you got AD. So that's rookie camp. So now we got max sauce. Down bad. That's all I'm going to say. Down bad. Max sauce spent 525k. That is three boxes. There are definitely something wrong with these numbers. Because that is three boxes. Oh, sorry. I'm not sure what... Um, the guy watching said he got spammed so badly by ads that um, he missed a couple of packs. So it wouldn't be it wouldn't be a max off stream without missing some of it because of ads. Um, shout out, Mike, though, good, really good guy. But from what he saw, fifty six rubies and lower, two Robins, one Scotty, no Wilkins, no Isaiah Thomas, no Anthony Davis. So about a hundred, give or take about a hundred and twenty dollars, about a hundred and twenty quid to get one Scotty Pippen and one two Robins, and fifty six rubies and lower. Fifty six. Ah, right, this is rough. This is grim at this stage. So then we get F thirteen X King, who spent the who spent five. Um, wait a minute. Sorry, I'm wrong. I'm wrong. Mac did not buy three. Okay, the numbers might be right. Mac did not buy three full boxes. Five, six, two, five hundred. That's that's three boxes. So in three boxes, he bought. He got four Robins, one Isaiah Thomas, one Dominique, two Scotty Pippins. So so far here in the amount of total packs, we're sitting here on. Let's just say close to 200 and we've got one Dominique, one Isaiah Thomas and one Anthony Davis. Nah, actually we're probably right at like 150-ish for three. So yeah, the less than 2% chance of both of them combined is give or take. And that's one in every 50 packs. So yeah, that's, that's give or take correct. And it's funny, like, when people see less than 2%, they're like, oh, it's not that bad. And it's like, when you actually see it in practice, what less than 2% actually is like. When you see in practice what less than 2% actually means, it is rough. Okay, so, after F13X King, we've got Ken WSG, who opened two boxes. There's definitely something off with these numbers. Am I, I just need to check my numbers again. I need to check, did I type something out wrong? Because you can't get that. You definitely cannot get that many packs for that little VC. No, it's it's down as that. So, so he opened fifty one packs. So I'm gonna I'm gonna change the numbers a little bit. So I do apologize with that. I'm gonna have to just change it just an estimate because the the numbers are definitely too low. But again, 48 packs. And you guys can see here. Or 48 rubies are one Robin, two Scotties. Nothing else. Sorry, there's one Dominique in there. There is one Dominique in there. I got it. I don't know how I messed up typing in this one wrong. I typed in this one completely wrong. There, he actually pulled one Dominique. So. One diamond through about 50 something packs. I mean, give or take, the odds are fairly accurate. They're just horrific. Okay, then we got Wildmont, who opened with MT. That's why it's not in this line. He opened 34 packs, or 35 packs, got two Pippins, one Robman, nothing else. So then we got Carlos Story, who opened two boxes and two and a couple of extra packs. So Carlos got... 39 rubies and lower, 
two Robins, two Pippins, no Diamonds, and one Anthony Davis. So give or take in 40-something packs, one of less than 2%. That kind of seems normal. That kind of seems normal. And then Henry the Blasian. Henry out here with 562,000 VC, three boxes bought, 55 rubies and lower. And like, the big thing with Henry's video is that like, Henry did get re Henry got really hyped in his video because he did pull all of the cards in the set. But you actually have to take into account how many packs the dude opened. Like you, I, and in fairness, I did watch the video. He definitely said while he's pulling them, it's like, these, these are odds are way better than normal. Uh, don't open packs. The problem is that he's correct. The odds are, but way better than normal. And shout out to him for actually discouraging it while getting these high pulls. But you can actually see the real breakdown. Two Rodmans, three Scotties from like 60 packs. And then one Dominique, one Anthony Davis, one Isaiah Thomas. If he doesn't pull Anthony Davis, this is a disaster of pack opening. If he doesn't pull Isaiah Thomas, this is still not that good. Like this 565 is like 130 quid. It is like 130 quid. Like, it's a lot of money. It is a lot. Like that is, I know again for us content creators, it doesn't seem like a lot of money. Like that is for the average person close to a day's worth, of, for the median person close to a day's worth of money. For the median person, if you're making twenty dollars an hour or twenty quid an hour, that's a an eight working eight hours a day. Before tax, that's a day's worth of money. It's mad. It's mad. And then last up, we have cheap ludes, who only opened ten packs, but he opened them all with MT, and he got one Dominique and nobody else. So, in total, in total, let me zoom out on this a little bit so you guys can see. So in total. We have 347 of 384 packs, 347 of them were lower than where Ruby or lower or a base at Amethyst. 13 Robmans, 16 Scotties. So there are 29 of 384, so less than 10%. A less than 10% chance on these Amethysts right here from what I've discovered. Then, Dominique Wilkins. You have got two Dominique, sorry, two Isaiah Thomases, four Dominiques. Two Isaiah Thomas cards. There were more ADs pulled than ITs. Three Anthony Davis pulled. So, of these guys right here, of 300 packs, there should be like seven. And there were nine. So there were actually more than 2% pulled in these. So as bad as this looks, this is actually better than 2K's advertised odds. This is actually better than 2K's advertised odds, which is nuts. You might think, oh, this is a disaster. These are actually better than their advertised odds. So you guys might think, oh, um, this is just a bad pack up. No, no, this is exceptionally good pack opening. This is way above the odds. This is an exceptional good. Uh, these people overall got lucky. And it's still this bad. It's still this bad. So overall, what was spent? 3 million VC. 600k MT. Let's just say 1 VC equals 1 MT. Like, I know it's not the case. But let's just have our cost for that. And not everyone's buying 450s. Because some people are buying 200. Some people are buying small amounts of VC. So I'm not going to base it off the cheapest way of buying VC. I'm going to base it off the 200k at $50. That is where I'm basing all of this off. And let's just say, hypothetically, 1 MT equals 1 VC. I know it doesn't quite equal the same... But it's like 0.8 VC or something. It's not, there's no point doing that. So, we have got, in total, I'm bringing a calculator onto the screen right now. Calculator.net. So, we're going to bring the calculator onto the screen right here. So, overall, we have got that what was spent. So, 308. 8250. And this is again, the numbers might be slightly off. Plus 590625. So that roughly 3.7 million divided by, where's it divided by? Divided by 200,000. Okay, I have, I forgot to hit the equals. Equals 
divided by 200 thousands. So that is eight, roughly 18.39 by 50. That is like 920 quid. Like, that is like 920 quid. I could definitely find somewhere else where someone opened, some guy opened two boxes to make this a thousand. But from like 920 quid, three 80s, four Dominiques, two Isaiah Thomases, you can spend a week's worth of money at a good paying job. And that's what you're getting. A week's worth of money. Like, we have to take into account how ridiculously bad these are. How ridiculously bad these packs are. And still, if we are looking at odds, even if you get lucky, like, look at this. This is 9 divided by 385. Like, this is a... Let's say, that's 7. 9 divided by 385 by 100. This is 2.3% of the diamond or a pink diamond. This is better than it should be. This is way better than the odds should be. And you would still, even if you get lucky, and this is all to my one person, even if you got lucky, 347 divided by 385 by 100. Even if you get lucky, you're still getting a 90% chance, a 90% chance at making a loss on your, there's no hell. Hell, like, there is no worse gambling. You are losing on your investment 90% of the time. You are going to lose. I know, I get it. If you win big, you win big. But you are going to lose a 90%. Like, this is a borderline entering the lottery levels of, like, poor investment. But anyway, yeah, that's pretty much it, lads. That's the pack opening video that you're going to see on this channel. That's the closest thing you're going to see. Let me know if you guys want to see me do this every single week. Breaking down what a thousand quid or give or take that amount from looking at streamers gets you. And shout out to all of these guys for putting, um, for making the content. Honestly, um, these guys, I can almost guarantee you to almost all of these guys, if not all of them have the exact same attitude, but they're just opening packs specifically for content. But anyway, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's the video. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe.